okay how we will go through the exemplar question in the equilibrium chapter okay before uh, going through the questions i uh, will show you some uh, basic formulas uh, we will be using the log functions here uh, there are two types of logs one is common log that is the log of base 10 or simply you can write as log log of that other is a natural log you can write this log of base e of some number or simply ln of x okay so here if i want to find the the common log of a number 10 then let us say you write 10 as 10 power 1 then this is 1 where log log of 10 is 1 Similarly, log of 100, 100 is 10 square, so log of 100 is 2. So, if you want to find the other number, something like 5, so anyway you will be using calculator, but the 5 is 10 power 0 0.698, so this log of 5 is 0 0.698. Here, just approximately you can find out, suppose log of say this number, uh, 1 by into 10 power minus 4 uh, because this is greater than 4 the value will be somewhere between 3 to 4 so this is the value 3.6 okay uh, if, if it is less than 1 let us say 0 0.4 in 10 power minus 4 then it will be somewhere between 4 to 5 so it is 4.3 actually my negative just saying 4.3 so this is approximately you can remember these values Similarly, ln of uh, 1 is 0. Here, uh, ln of 1 is 0. Um, ln of here you say 10 power. Here, because this is a e log uh, e of x, so that is 2.718. So, log of 2.718 is uh, 1. Log of 7.4 you can write uh, as ln of 2. 718 of power 2 that is 7 so it is 2 so similarly ln of 5 it will come so anyway you will be using the calculator okay mm, this is the log function you see mm, uh, this is x and y when uh, x equal to 1 that uh, log function is 0 here and if uh, log of x that is uh, x is less than 1 then it is a negative number and log of uh, that x is greater than 1 then it will be a positive number ok so uh, there are some formulas uh, you can remember is uh, pH ok close it and open okay uh, ph plus poh is 14 similarly pka plus pkb is 14 ph equals so from this uh, formula you can write to if a given poh then you can find ph as 14 minus poh similarly if they given ph poh you can write 14 minus ph similarly this pka plus pkb is 14 and you can write these formulas pk is uh, minus log of ka pkb minus log of kb so here uh, ph is minus log of uh, hydroxide uh, and concentration and uh, ph let us say so here uh, this if you write uh, if you want given the ph if you want to find the concentration of this hydroxide ion then 10 power minus ph let us say example ph is given 3.8 find the hydroxide concentration 10 power minus 3.8 is this number ok pH is less than 7 means acidic pH is greater than 7 is basic pH equal to 7 means neutral so this is how you can find the pH value given pKw, pKa and pKb kW is only into 10 power minus 14 ok Okay, now we know that the relation between uh, the Kp and Kc is uh, Kp equal to Kc that is uh, um, equilibrium constant for uh, liquid and this is for the gas uh, for the gas that is partial pressure 
what would be the value of delta n for the reaction this so delta n is number of moles of gaseous products minus number of moles of the gaseous reactions only you have to consider only gaseous so here this is a solid reactant so here you should not consider this so gas 1 mole 1 mole so 1 plus 1 2 minus here 0 there is no gas so it is a 2 the answer is 2 is 11 so here they are given what is a delta n delta n the number of moles of the gaseous products minus number of moles of the gaseous reactants okay for the reaction this the standard free energy uh, delta g n s greater than zero the equilibrium constant k would be okay here uh, i will show you uh, what is the relation between the delta g minus and k see here delta g minus that is standard gives free energy equal to minus rt ln k okay if k equal to 1 means then ln of log of 1 is 0 so this delta g will become 0 k is less than 1 then it will be negative number and there is one more negative so then it will become positive so in k is greater than 0 the ln of greater than this is a positive number and there is a negative so it will become negative so now uh, delta g uh, so this is the correct answer because delta g is greater than 0 the k is less than 1 go here 17 so this is the similar problem here here you can go through it see here which of the following uh, is not not a general characteristic of the equilibrium involving the physical process equilibrium is possible only in the closed system at a given temperature this is the correct all measurable properties of the system remains constant correct? all the physical process will stop at equilibrium no, this is not correct so the arising is not correct the opposing process occur at the same rate and there is a dynamic equilibrium okay it's also correct so the answer uh, third is uh, the correct one So you can see the some of the points are given what will happen the physical process in the equilibrium okay pcl5 pcl3 and cl2 are at equilibrium at this temperature in a closed container and their concentrations are they are given actually the value of this key c for the reaction is okay we have to find the equilibrium constant so four so this is the general equation to find the equilibrium constant so this is the number of moles a b c d so uh, this is the general equation they have given the what is the concentration of uh, these things here number of moles are one 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 in this equation the number of moles of the products and the reactants are one so after simplification we will get this 1.8 in 10 power minus 3 so this is the correct answer okay so here 9 and 10 So here this is the general equation, okay. And there is a uh, this formula is given.
which of the following statement is incorrect incorrect okay the equilibrium mixture of ice and water in perfectly insulated insulated see uh, there is no change there man uh, ice and water uh, does not change with this with the time this is actually correct so i ask incorrect the intensity of the red color increases when the oxalic acid is added to a solution containing iron nitrate and the potassium ions. the addition of the catalyst at the equilibrium value is not affected okay equilibrium constant for the reaction with the negative uh, delta h value decreases the temperature increases okay this is the correct answer you give 19 19 okay so here they are given intensity of when you add this uh, b ions uh, the concentration of the decreases the intensity of the red color increases okay you can go through this the nitrochloric acid is added to the gobal nitrate solution at the room temperature the following reaction takes place and the reaction mixture becomes blue and cooling down then again it becomes a pink on the basis of this information mark the correct answer and so here they are given you have to find the delta h yeah, this is for the endothermic reaction um, so now i will show you 2020 okay mm. proceeds in the forward direction mm. Mm. so this is related to the enthalpy okay so the equilibrium constant for the exothermic reaction so exothermic decreases as the temperature increases So uh, this is the equation they have given. This is a endothermic reaction. So delta H is uh, greater than zero for this reaction. The pH of neutral water they are given as seven and the temperature increases, the ionization of the water increases. However, the concentration of the H plus they are all equal. What will be the pH of the see when the concentration of the H plus increases then pH decreases as per the formula? Seven. See here uh, this is the formula. pH equal to minus negative log of uh, hydroxide and concentration so if you increase the temperature H plus uh, that uh, concentration increases when this value increases pH will decrease okay when pH is uh, less than 7 so the pH is less than 7 but uh, because these two are in uh, same con equal H plus and uh, OH minus are in equal concentration um, they still is uh, neutral the ionization constant of an acid K is the measure of the strength of an acid. The K values are given for the following acid. Which of the following pH of uh, for this concentration? For uh, they have taken the same concentration. For the same concentration, uh, that is less strength means more pH based on the formula. So I will compute for there are three acids are given. I will take which one which highest concentration, lowest concentration. See the trend and choose the answer. Eight. So first I in the formic acid and I am using this formula so they are given the ionization constant and the uh, concentration 0.1 mole so this is the pH is this this is for the 10 power minus 4 this is the highest value is given similarly for the lowest value so you see from that uh, pH of the highest and low H 
lowest higher concentration have lower pH lower concentration have higher pH so the value of the lower concentration will come first and then the higher concentration will come as the last less Ka means more pH so the order will be this is the uh, this is the less concentration that means more pH they are asking the pH so this will be greater than this this will be greater than this this is the ionization constant um, of this intermediate stages are given so they are asking for this reaction uh, they are asking uh, one, the corresponding relationship between uh, these things so this is the correct answer that is given in the two. See here, this uh, the net constant is the uh, multiplication of the constant of the intermediate stages. Okay, acidity of this uh, boron trifluoride can be explained on the basis of which of the following comes. This is the Lewis constant, 25. So BF3 does not have boron does not have a proton but still acts as an acid and reacts with the NH3. Okay. So this is the answer. Lewis concept. These concepts are expense different things. Which of the following will produce a buffer solution? when uh, mixed in the equal volumes you see um, the buffer means there will be a, a strong acid as well as a base when you add a, a little bit of acid pH will not change similarly when you add a little bit of base also pH will not change so in this reaction after the reaction you will uh, get the NH for Cl plus some uh, unutilized NH4 OH also will be there so in the buffer solution will have acid as well as base so this is the answer so here if you see 34 that problem is similar problem So this this problem is similar. You can go through it. In which of the following uh, solvent the silver chloride is uh, most soluble? So you have to write uh, the chemical reaction HCl and the uh, ammonia. So this is the correct answer. What will be the pH of uh, this many moles? Ka and C is given. So if from that you can find the hydroxide ion concentration. From the hydroxide ion concentration you can again find the pH. 13. See here a pH you have to find that is a negative log of hydroxide ion concentration. In this concentration you can find using the ionization constant and the uh, this uh, concentration. So you can find this, this is the ionization constant. Then from that you can find the pH. So this is 3.4. Uh, you can this will be 0, 0, 0. It will be 4.2 into 10 power minus 4. Minus 4 means uh, because it is 4.2 into 10 power, it will be between 3 and 4. This pH from that itself, we can choose this is 3.4. Okay, so here you can choose this is the 3.4. Okay, K for uh, this, KB for uh, this. What is the pH of um, they are asking the pH? This is the formula. 
I'll show you. Fourteen. P H of P K W P K A and K B P K B C P K A equal to minus of K A. So these two terms are same. So here minus so this will cancel each other. P K W equal to negative log of K W is one into ten power minus fourteen. Okay. So when you write only ten power minus fourteen because this is log base ten. Ten power minus fourteen will become fourteen. So uh, substitute the half into fourteen. These two items will cancel out. Then then you will get seven. The answer is seven. Which of the following options will be correct for the stage of the half completion of the reaction? Um, this A equilibrium with B. Answers. In uh, delta G equal to the standard uh, free energy zero. Just uh, when uh, off completion at the stage of the off completion, A equal B. Therefore, K equal to one. And K equal to one means L n of one will be zero. So this will, this term will become thus. Uh, this way, delta G standard gives free energy is zero. So this is zero. On increasing the pressure, which direction will the gas phase reaction proceed uh, to really re-establish the equilibrium? This is predicted by applying the lead charge phase principle. Consider the reaction. Which of the following is correct? If the total pressure at which the equilibrium is established, it is increased without changing the temperature. That is at constant temperature. At constant temperature, the K will remain the same. Sixteen. According to the Lee Charger principle, at constant temperature, the equilibrium composition will change, but K still will remain the same. Composition will change, but K will will be same. What will be the correct order of the vapor pressure of the water? Um, Given among these corresponding water as the maximum boiling point, either as the minimum boiling point. So we have to find the uh, this relation between the vapor pressure and the boiling point. Okay, three. So here you see. The liquid which has the higher vapor pressure is more volatile and has the lower boiling point. So the higher the vapor pressure, the lower the boiling point. So based on that, uh, this is the given uh, this um, the, um, the water as the maximum boiling point. So that will have the lower vapor pressure. What will be the correct order of the vapor pressure? So this is a less vapor pressure than this. This because this is having more boiling point. At 400 K equilibrium constant for the following reaction, they are given. Okay, uh, what will be the equilibrium constant for this reaction? So here from this reaction, actually they multiplied this reaction by two and then reversed it. When you multiply two, then it will become this will become one mole, half mole become one mole. This will also become one mole. This will become two mole. Then reverse it. So we have to apply two rules here. One is for the multiplication, other is for the reverse reaction. So here uh, eighteen. So this is the reaction. First time, uh, this is the K is given. I multiply two uh, as per uh, from the book. When you multiply K by some value, then you have to uh, K. If you multiply two, then K power two will become. Then five square is twenty five. Uh, second, we are going to reverse the reaction so that K will become one by one by K. So this is K twenty five here. For the reaction, then we are reversing the reaction. So one by twenty five zero point zero four. Similarly, I am giving one more example. Two N O plus uh, this is K hundred means. What will be the K for this? 
okay they are uh, actually uh, so what they have done so actually they, they multiply this by the half okay 1 by 2 uh, 1 2 becomes 1 this will be 1 by 2 and this will become also 1 so they are multiplied so k power 1 by 2 so if k is 100 and power 1 by 2 that is root then it is 10 So you can see this table here also in the book. And this is this table, the chemical ligation, equilibrium constant. For this K means, so this is see they reversed the equation, then it will become 1 by K. And then they multiplied this equation, then it will be K power. In which of the following reactions the equilibrium remains unaffected and the addition of the small amount of organ at the constant volume. Okay, so the equilibrium will remain uh, unaffected in all the three cases. Okay. Right. Well, temperature okay if the volume is kept constant and an inert gas such as organ is added which does not take part in the reaction the equilibrium remains undisturbed okay question number 20 for the reaction the value of the k not 400 k and the 1700 at 500 kg. What is the which of the options is correct? <coughs> the, the reaction is endothermic and uh, this uh, is a mixture with 400 k at partial pressure of 20 bar and 2 bar respectively. <coughs> More endo 4 will be formed. The entropy of the system increases. 50. Okay, uh, and it reaction first from the right, it reaction uh, to right. So, the these are the things. My answer K increases with the increase in temperature, Q is greater than when the reaction moves in the backward direction. Delta N is greater than 0 means delta is greater than 0. Entropy is increases. At a particular temperature at most pressure, the solid and liquid phases of the cube system can exist in equilibrium. Yes, which of the following terms defines this temperature? Two. See here, for any few substance at a most present temperature at which the solid and liquid phases are at equilibrium is called the normal melting point and normal freezing point. So this is normal melting point and freezing point. The ionization of hydrochloric acid is given. Hydro, sorry, hydrochloric using water is given. Label two conjugate acid and base pairs in the ionization. Twenty four. See here. The acid base conjugate acid and conjugate base. The aqueous solution of sugar does not conduct electricity. However, sodium chloride is added in water, it conducts electricity. How will you explain this uh, statement on the basis of the ionization? How it is affected by the concentration of the sodium chloride? 
sugar does not ionize in water but the sodium chloride NaCl ionizes completely in water and produces Na plus and Cl minus ions. So this, this will conduct electricity. Conductance increases with the increase in concentration of salt due to release of more ions. Boron trifluoride does not have a proton. This is Lewis concept, but still act as an acid reacts with this NH3. Why it so? What type of bond is formed? So this is Lewis concept. So here uh, here it does not have a proton, but still act as an acid reacts with NH3 by accepting the lone pair of electrons. So you can go through the, what is this Lewis concept and how it uh, this boron trifluoride acts as acid. The yeah, answer 24. Da3 acts as Lewis acid as it is electron deficient compound and the coordinate bond is formed in this reaction. Ionization constant of a weak base is given by this expression. Ionization is the measure of strength. Yes, ionization constant is the measure of strength. L is of the ionization constant of the base, sum of the weak bases at a particular temperature is given. Arrange it based on decreasing order of the extent of the ionization equilibrium. Mm, which of these above is, is the strongest? 25. Order of the extent of the ionization equilibrium is given like this. So urea is the last. Eh? Since dimethylene will ionize to the maximum extents, it is the strongest strongest base. Okay, this is the strongest base. 25. Conjugate acid of a weak base is always stronger. What will be the decreasing order of the strength of the following conjugate bases? 26. Okay, this is order. 27. Arrange the following in the increasing order of the pH. Increasing order of the pH. The lowest pH first. 27. So, this is the lowest pH. Okay, highest pH. The helium is for the reaction at a given time. The composite of the reaction mixture is okay. Um, in which direction will the reaction proceed? We have to compare that QC and KC. 15. 28. Okay, they are find QC as the value of the reaction coefficient is greater than the KC. The reaction will produce in the reverse direction. It will proceed in the reverse direction. Okay, these are the KC and Q, QC comparison values. On the basis of the equation, pH is the negative log of the, the hydrogen and concentration. pH is 8. However, it is observed that it is less than 7. We explain the reason. Concentration of 10 power minus 5 indicate that the solution is very dilute. And the concentration of the concentration from water is significant. And 
should also be included in the calculation of the pH 29. The pH of a strong acid is 5. What will be the pH of a solution obtained after diluting the given solution 100 times? This is the pH. After dilution and then concentration will become this. And uh, the pH for this is 7. Okay. And calculating is using the pH negative law. And then it will become 7. It is not for this. Indicate the duration is very dilute. Hence, add an ion concentration. Okay, it is contribution of ion concentration of water. So if you apply logarithm on this, uh, logarithm 10 power minus 7 is 7, then logarithm of 2 pH. The sparingly soluble salt becomes precipitated only on the product of the concentration of the solution becomes greater than the solubility product. If the solubility of the BACL is given, calculate the solubility of the this many moles of the HDSO4 31. Solubility at T time T is 0 0, at equilibrium solubility is S. And then they are finding the value of the S. Okay, yes. KSP equals this expression. KSP in the presence of the sulfuric acid will be as follows. Since the value of KSP will not change in the presence of the sulfuric acid, therefore, I will not do okay. So you can go through this answer. Okay. 31. PH of uh, this many moles of is this calculate the ionization constant. Mm -hmm. Ionization constant. So the given pH and the concentration, you have to find the ionization constant. pH equal to negative log of this. So negative pH equal log of this. Okay, they are finding the concentration. And then from this equation, they are finding the ionization constant. Calculate the pH of the solution formed by mixing these two solutions A and B, whose pH is 6 and 4. They have to find the concentration of the combined solution. From there, again, they have to find the pH, 33. So, this for this pH, uh, this is the concentration. And for this pH, and this is the concentration. Now, the total solution and the total concentration they are finding. From the total concentration, again, they are computing the pH. The solubility product we is, is, is this calculate the solubility in the gram per liter and also find the pH of the solutions 34. Okay, so at the start solubility and at the equilibrium, this is uh, this. See here, the important thing is here this balance is the equation here, three moles here, three moles. Okay, whenever you do the problems related to solubility, solubility product constant, the you have to balance the equation. And the finding yes, then the solubility of this they are binding pH. Okay. Okay. Calculate the volume of water required to dissolve 0.1 gram of lead chloride to get the saturation solution of this uh, um, solubility product constant is given for this 35. 
100 consent let s be the solubility the constant is at time 0 0 at equilibrium this is the solubility constant ksp ksp for this okay so from the equation i guess uh, this two moles Okay, from there they are finding the S. Yes. Uh, finding the S. Yes. Okay. Then the from the molar mass, uh, they are computing the solubility in terms of a gram per liter. To get the saturated solution of 0 0.05. Uh, 6 gram of uh, this PVCL it is dissolved in 1 liter 0.1 gram is dissolved in 0.1 to make a saturated solution the solution of 0.1 gram of, in, of water will be required so you can go through this answer the reaction between the ammonia boron trifluoride is given ok this is a Lewis concept. Identify the acid base in this reaction. Which theory explains is what is the hybridization of En in this reaction? P36 into 25. So, this is the Lewis acid base concept. Mm, this is that reaction, so that you can go through it. So BF3 does not have a proton, but still has a acid, so you can go through the details here. For the following data given, the reaction, okay. Mm, predict the effect of temperature on the equilibrium constant of the reaction, 37. The, the reaction enthalpy is given. The reaction is in endothermic. Okay. Hence, according to the Leach also, the reaction will proceed the polarization, the increasing the temperature. Thirty-seven. Twenty. Okay. The equilibrium for the endothermic reaction first it does increases the temperature increases. The equilibrium constant for the exothermic reaction decreases the temperature. So this is the effect of the temperature uh, on the equilibrium constant. Matching type. Match the following equilibrium is so liquid to vapor. Liquid to vapor is boiling point. Solid to liquid. Solid to liquid is the melting point. Solid to liquid is a melting point. Solid to vapor. Vapor is the sublimation. Solid to solid. The solid uh, so, so, solid in the solid state. To solid in the solution. Okay, this is saturated solution. For the reaction, they are given equilibrium constant. Okay, some reactions are written in the below in the column one and the equilibrium constant. Okay, match the following uh, the corresponding. So uh, this is the answer, and that is given in this book in this uh, table seven point four as which table. See here, see what will happen when you reverse the reaction, when you multiply the reaction for something. So this is you say used here. So here this is used here. See for this reaction, 
Mm, this is uh, the, they are multiplying uh, this reaction. Okay, they have multiplied this reaction by two. Okay, so you are uh, putting the power of two. Then for this reaction, they are uh, reverse. So they are, are dividing by the k. And for this reaction, you are multiplying by one by two. So this is k power one by two. I already shown in the uh, some other uh, thing also some other question also. Match the standard free energy of the reaction with the following equilibrium also. Mm, delta G is minus RT ln K. Minus RT ln K greater than 0 means K is less than 1. So that will be less than 1 means negative number. So minus minus will become plus. So that is greater than 0. Delta G is less than 0 that is K is greater than 1. So ln of k then in positive number minus r t then it will be a negative number. So that is less than zero. This is k equal to one. This is for the k equal to one. Match the following with the corresponding conjugate acid. Okay. This is B mm, C D. Match the following graphical variation with the description. C. Variation in reactant concentration with the time. The concentration of the reaction decreases as the time increases. Okay. This is what this is. This is E. Varies in the product. The product concentration increases as the time increases. B. Reaction at the equilibrium, the product and the uh, then concentration will become equal. Match the criteria on and with equilibrium. At the equilibrium, this uh, if free energy is zero, standard uh, free energy is zero. Uh, delta G also delta G equal to delta G minus. Spontaneous reaction yeah, that is less than zero and k is greater than one. Non spontaneous is less greater than okay. The following question is statement assertion, then there is a reason. Increasing order of the acidity of the hydrogen halides, okay, they are given reason while comparing the acid formed by the elements belonging to the same group in the periodic table. HA bond strength is more important factor than determining the in determining the acidity of the acid than the polar nature of the bond. Okay, both A and P are true. A and R are true, and R is the correct explanation of the A. A solution containing mix of acidic acid and the sodium okay, maintain the constant pH and the addition of the small amount of the acid are also there is a buffer solution. Okay, the solution containing the mixture of uh, the buffer solution. Okay, the, this is correct. Both E and R are true, and R is the correct expression of E. Ionization of the hydrogen sulfide in water is low in the presence of hydrochloric acid. Hydrogen sulfide is a weak acid. Mm, both A and R are true, but R is uh, this is not the correct explanation of the A. For any chemical reaction at a particular temperature, the equilibrium constant is fixed. No, no, no. Uh, this reason is not true. The equilibrium constant is independent of the temperature. No. Reason. A is true, but R is false. Aqueous solution of ammonium carbonate is basic. Acidic base nature of the salt solution of the salt and weak acid. Uh, of the acidic, okay. Both A and B are true, and R is the correct explanation of the A. 
the acute solution of ammonia acid it can act as a buffer acetic acid is a weak acid and NH4 is a weak base A is false and R is true yes, this is a weak base in the dissociation of PBCL5 at constant pressure and temperature addition of the helium noble gas in the days at equilibrium increases the dissociation of the PCL5 helium removes Cl2 from the field of the action no this is the answer both A and, uh, A and R are false how can you predict in the following stages of reaction by comparing the value of K and Q. Okay, 15. Okay, here they are given the relation between the reaction coefficient Q and the equilibrium constant. Okay, so you can go through it. This is his explanation. For the following cases, fifty one uh, less than K net reaction proceed in the forward direction. Uh, Q is greater than K net reaction produced in the backward direction e equal to K that is equilibrium. No net reaction, not equal, no net reaction occurs. And the basis of the literature principle explain how the temperature and pressure can be adjusted to increase the yield of ammonia in the following reaction. So, this is a given detail in the book 20. Okay, so here uh, this reaction mm, low temperature is favorable for the high yield of ammonia. So here they are given the explanation of how you can increase the ammonia. Spirally solid uh, soluble salt having the general formula uh, molar availability. Solubility, yes, is in equilibrium and saturated solution. Derive the relationship between the solubility and solubility product for such a salt. 53. Given, I think, hint. So, you have to use this to derive the formula. Write the relationship between delta G. Uh, gives free energy and the reaction coefficient uh, define the meaning of the each term and answer the following how uh, the reaction proceeds uh, and they explain these things ok 54 This is the reason delta G equal to delta G and RTL and Q. Delta G minus is RTL and K. Okay. So this is when we say L and of A by B, L and of A minus L and of B. So RT if you take common L and of Q minus L and of K. So that in this way you write L and of Q by K. So then Q is less than k that means this is uh, less than 1 that is less than 1 negative number uh, negative number so uh, the uh, negative number so delta g is negative ok when q, uh, when q is less than k so the reaction proceeds in the forward direction Okay, Q is less than K, they are positive in the forward direction.
क्योंकि सेम थी दे ही बनी है there is no net reaction when delta g equal delta g minus then there is no reaction here relate q with the concentration of this and the reduced volume increase the pressure so that k is less than a and hence the reaction proceeds in the forward direction okay see you have to try out yourself and uh, find the uh, answers okay the uh, i have summarized all the formulas uh, from the book you can go through the formulas uh, 